many people are coming to the execution tomorrow. <laughs> I'm not a corporal. The one who killed the Empress and abducted her daughter, Emily. So it's an occasion. Right. A social event for the High and Mighty. Come see the noble Lord Protector get his head chopped off. You're as bad as us betting on the dogfights. Attention. The solitary wing is off limits to maintenance crews unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. To check the yard? Yeah, but I had to crack skulls. Lazy bastards. If they don't want to work, they don't get their ration of elixir. Military or the plague? Life is hard. Ugh. Execution is tomorrow, right? <laughs> Maybe. Either way, let's just dump them down there. Let the rats eat them.
won't get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take them out alone. What's that? here. I'm Samuel, and I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. Well, they said you'd come out here, but I can still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them, just down the river from here. up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. And then there are the real odd birds living on the fringes like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. Don't know which is worse. Just take your pick. Make my own way back to the Hound Pits. I was just reading in the archive about that heretic's brand. It sounds beautiful. Have you ever seen the ritual? I've never seen the heretic's brand used. No. But I did spy the face of Did you get caught in the lockdown last night? Six hours. Search the place top to bottom. And nothing to eat but the swill. Or free. Of course we didn't. Did I ever tell you, one time one of the second floor shutters got stuck open, and I thought I could slip out? I couldn't find a way down. By the time I got back and it snapped shut, I spent the rest of lockdown out on a ledge. <laughs> Maybe the outside was watching. I hear the watch is having trouble holding the side streets. Bunch of children playing games, that's all. Good, good. And your niece, Callista, isn't it? A very good sense. She'll be fine. My men are searching district by district. The poor girl. Callista's a resourceful one. Probably found a safe place to hold up in all this chaos. If my overseers hear any word, I'll come straight to you. Time for drinks. I hope you won't refuse. It'll make this business pass all the quicker. Ah, what are the 
servants must have been in here. Let me see. It seems I have the wrong one. Not that one. No. Ah, here we are. Now if you'll join me. Men will come get you when we're finished. Keep each other entertained in the meantime. I don't understand how this got so unpleasant. Oh, I agree, I agree. A whore dies and suddenly this. That might be worth checking out. Oh, I'll find you. Sister, she's not a witch. I know her. Out of the way. You expect preferential treatment just because you are her brother? She will. So she's over there. Die, idiot! <laughs> Campbell lived a pretty posh life. Maybe it's not my place to say, 
but men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. Are you ready to go? Okay, let's go. I'll get you as close as I can to the Golden Cat, Corvo. You'll have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holger Square. The main thing is to make sure that little girl, Emily, gets back all safe and sure. Them two Pendletons are there, so I'm guessing there'll be a lot of guards. Slackjaw might have some ideas on helping you get inside the cat, if he don't kill you. This here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Be careful going there. Think. I think he's dead, right? I know that. I mean, do we have suspects? Suspects? What? Suspects? We ain't gonna waste time solving who killed him. Personally, I'd buy who did it a drink. But what are you gonna put on your report? I'm gonna say we found one of Slackjaw's men inside, all dead and bloody, and that you are a stinking idiot. Might be worth checking out. That him? Easy, easy. You just need a bit. Ain't you heard? Slack jumpers, the good stuff for himself. Where? What's this? Information from my missing guy. Let's have a listen. Slackjaw, it's me, Crowley. I'm making this in case I don't make it back. He was right. There is someone once you did. Once they take over the distillery, 
than the whole Bottle Street gang. And you'll never believe who it is, neither. At first, I did. That's why it taken me so long. I wanted to be sure, and... What's that? <coughs> ah! No! No! Ah! So Kral is dead. The cat's having a big... Now Morgan's on the first floor. I need to get the men in position. The ivory room. All I can tell you. This whole place has gone to the hell. Talk to that nice girl again. When I told you, Dumpsters. you're here. You're supposed to be on duty. Come on. You're supposed to be. Finally. Oh. oh. Oh, that's good. I deserve that one. Shall I tell you why? The Pendletons are here, right? Start with them. I cheated them. Robbed them of thousands. Oh. You're ruthless. Don't hold back. I'll tell you everything. Pendleton's inheritance was worth hundreds of thousands at least. I told them it was junk. Ah! Ah! Retribution! Retribution! Ah, that was perfect. But it's all I can take for tonight. Call my servants. We're done. Ah! We're done, I said. Retribution! Now let me out! this? What do you want? The safe. Yes, of course. The combination is 879. Take anything you find. I think I felt my heart skip.
You brought me the number. Both ready to go? Corvo, you must have worked wonders out there in the city tonight. I can't believe my old eyes. so maybe you haven't visited the bridge before tonight. Something to look out for. See all them lights on the water? That's right. We'll be spotted for sure. You're gonna have to shut off their power before I can pick you up. Now, about bringing Sokolov back alive, he's smart. Maybe even smarter than Piero. Got the whole of Dunwall under his thumb with all that natural philosophy business. New technology, potions and the like. Seems dangerous to me, but what do I know? Here we are. You understand now. Curfew means there's nobody allowed to be just wandering about, except us guards. Yeah, I know. I know. If we do say something, then what? Say something. visitors to our city. By order of the region, the curfew is now active. No any more men to the Ark Pylons. Touch the charger before your shift when the duty officer brings it by, and the Ark Pylon will fry you. Those things? Give me the
turn my abilities to formula. You made a neat job of it. Drop him here and we'll be off. People don't remember. Excuse me. You should see this as an opportunity. To what? Learn a trade. I know your mission tonight. We must speak. Privately. You can do so again. Land is worthless now. Hold on. I need a cigar. Friend of Pendleton. Her name is Ezra. I won't harm her. If you I want swear. to be beaten, I'll run out of hands. Let your family Just bring you to the cellar <laughs> and we'll keep her safe with me. Welcome to the Boyle Estate. Oh. Hello, handsome. Oh, really? Who am I then? In the flesh. Now, do you know what my sisters are wearing. You're serious, aren't you? I'm really in danger. Oh, but this is perfect. I love it. What happens next? Are you gonna tie me up? Oh, yes, of course I can. Anything. You, a gentleman? I'll have you know I'm as... Bless you. I say nothing against the Lord Regent. He's the only one holding this together. Excuse me. You! Put the weapon away and get out of here before I put my men on you! in the oracular order make a pronouncement regarding the plague soon.
Jesus. At last. Oh, my love. Someday you will understand. You'll never know how happy you've made me. Someday she'll learn to appreciate me. After all, she'll have her whole life. You enjoyed your evening, sir. But we'd best be on our way. Quickly. Dunwall Tower might not be good ones, huh? So maybe you can make up for what happened back then. It'll be a bit of a climb from the water lock. Most important thing is killing the Lord Regent. He built himself quite a place at the top of the tower. He calls it his safe room or something. Crazy if you ask me. Another point of interest while I'm giving you the grand tour, Corvo. Broadcast control station here where all them announcements come from. Might be worth looking into. Ready? Next time I see you, the Lord Regent will be dead. And if not, well, it was an honor to serve with you. possession to the city watch please please don't hurt me you're here to kill the regent aren't you spare my life and i can help you beat him he makes recordings on audiograph secrets yes as you wish Lord. keep this area secure and use that alarm if there's any sign of trouble yes sir
If I explain, then you will see. I am not at fault. My poverty was meant to bring prosperity to the city, to rid us of the stone. What are you doing? Waste the days and fill them. Drink. Is it all done? You ready to go back to the Hound Pits? Thanks to you, Corvo. All right, let's go. Lost it all. Ruined at last. Lord Regent. Royal Spy Master. Hiram Burroughs. You small, worried man. You'll never know how many times I've thought about trying to get close to you again. Just to put a piece of sharp metal in your eye. But now there's no need. You've been taken down by the same apparatus that gave you life to begin with. Laws and courtrooms and the mighty swell of public outrage. Good riddance to you, sir. So many schemes you had, so many contracts. So many people that I killed for you. None like the last. None like her. I'd give back all the coin if I could.
don't see what took so long. I'm going to boil off the nasty fat and sinew, and carve... Please! men are still trying to penetrate the workshop. Close up tight. We think Piero Joplin's inside. Crackpot, natural philosopher. There is evidence that Anton Sokolov was held here against his will for some time. We can't determine what happened to him. I'll bet my commission is in that building with Piero Joplin. If so, arrest him. But I don't want him harmed until I get to the bottom of all this. Careful. The place may be booby-trapped and I want him alive. What else? Yes, sir. Servants were all executed shortly before we arrived. Looks like a naval cutlass and a small pistol. Looks like Corvo.
Corvo ran amok before he left. Mm -hmm. Turn this building inside out. And it goes without saying, this area is sealed. Mm -hmm. Still walkers at all points. Mm -hmm. And stay vigilant. Corvo's the most dangerous man in the Empire now. So he has nowhere else to go. Never thought he'd bother us again. Died by Corvo. Thought I'd find you here. It never pays to bet against you, does it? I saw the signal. I knew you'd be back, Corvo. I knew it. We'll need to get out of here soon. The Admiral controls the military now, Martin's high overseer, and Pendleton's in favor with the aristocracy and Parliament. They need Emily, of course. But if Havelock senses that it's all about to fall down around him, who knows what he's liable to do? Good. There's one more trip across the river to where it meets the sea. That's where the Lord Regent was building his new lighthouse. Ought to be something to see. This is it, sir. I suspect Havelock Martin and Lord Pendleton landed there a while ago and went into the lighthouse. Knowing them, they're not giving up without a fight. I remember hearing the Admiral and Martin talking about this place as where they'd hold up if they had to. Anybody going in has to breach the fort, the gatehouse, and then there's only one way to the top. All I can say is that it's been a pleasure serving with you. Maybe after all this is settled, we'll see each other again. Good luck, Corvo. If anyone deserves it, you do. Give my best to Emily. After you. You, Corvo? Sorry, Who is that? Corvo! I knew you'd come. Is he going to be okay now? Will I be Empress?
So ends the interregnum, and now Emily Caldwin I will take her mother's throne after a season of turmoil. You will stand at her side, Corvo, guiding her young mind and protecting her from those who seek to exploit her or cause her harm. You watched and listened when other men would have shouted in rage. You held back instead of striking. So it is, with the passing of the plague and Emily's ascension, comes a golden age brought about by your hand. And decades hence, when your hair turns white and you pass from this world, Empress Emily, Emily the Wise, at the height of her power, will lay your body down within her mother's great tomb, because you are more to her than royal protector. Farewell, Corvo.